task that we've been set with is um, from Network Rail wanting to modernise Manchester Victoria Station from being one of the worst stations in the country into one of the best stations in the country. We've been subcontracted by Morgan Sindel as the specialist steelwork contractor to provide the approximately 1,800 tonnes of structural steelwork uh, for the new roof. The main feature of the new roof are the 15 major ribs. These ribs come from anything from 62 tonnes up to the one that we're going to be erecting tonight. Which is rib 9, biggest one of all of them. Which is approximately 87 tonnes and is 95 metres long. Rib 9 has probably taken in the region about 2,000 man-hours to fabricate, to draw, to assess the temporary work scheme, to paint it, to get it here. We've been working on it now for about four or five weeks, coming up with different crane schemes, making sure that we've got it in the right place, I've got the right weights on the crane, have we got the right radiuses. The constraints you can see inside is very, very tight, so we've got to make sure that with the crane operator that he's happy, we've got to make sure that the client's happy, the ground surface is okay. It's like a game of chess. We're constantly moving pieces around to release areas, to give us more space, to bring pieces in. The biggest challenge that we've got is the time scale that we have to, to erect these particular items. We have to wait until the, the pick-up from Network Rail hands over the O-Elite, then we're allowed to move over the isolated electrification line into position. We've got to put two connecting purlins in place to secure the load, and then we can let the big crane slew back into the yard. But we only have three and a half hours to do this particular operation, which is very, very tight. So that in itself is, is a major, major uh, concern and something that we've got to address. We're pretty confident that this one is, uh, is going to go up OK. Which I think is a fantastic team effort from the whole of Severs. Every job that we construct within the UK or overseas is always unique. It's always challenging, which is why we work here. We, we, we want to work on projects that are things that people can look at and say, you know, I've, I've, had a, I've had a part in that and we have the best guys who work for us anyway, so it's a, it's a real honour to be here. <laughs>